Okay, so my name is Ingrid and I'm from Melbourne, Australia. <clears throat> and um, I've come here because I wanted to, um, I felt like my soul was asking me to start um, my real life because I felt like I wasn't living my true spirit, my, my, my life. Um, I was, I have been running a business, a very successful business and um, I have, <clears throat> I was became trapped in, in the amount of money I was making and I wasn't, I wasn't happy, my soul wasn't happy but I was attached to the money and what that was buying me and what that was getting me and um, uh, I was basically buying happiness, I wasn't happy, I would buy a lot of stuff, I was a shopaholic, I used to buy tons of clothes and um, and I wasn't I didn't really know how to extend my spirit I didn't have a very good connection with people um, I was quite isolated and I used to smoke a lot of marijuana and um, just feeling like I'm not living my spirit and um, I knew that I had to do something drastic to to shift that and I had to go really I had to do something deep to um, touch my spirit and have the courage to move on from my business. So I decided to come to the temple of the way of light to um, access my spirit through ayahuasca and that's what I've done. I've had a really stern talking to from ayahuasca. She's been very stern with me and she's been very um, strict and very strong in my in my journeys and I realize that she has been so strong with me to um, to get me to look at myself seriously because I don't think I was taking my spirit seriously my life seriously and I lacked respect for myself and uh, my environment and and people and um, I I've had a very tough, um, some very tough journeys, but I believe that that's what I needed to um, to take myself more seriously, to take um, life more seriously. And when I say seriously, value, value and appreciate life. And so she's been showing me what my spirit is seeking, and I'm affirming it, going, yeah, that's what I want, that's what I want to do. So what's happened is it's been really hard the journeys have been really hard and at the same time showing me well if you want what you want which is what I want is to be a dancer and travel more and um, find my creative spirit and all of that and she said if you want that then you have to be serious about it and you have to make a commitment to your spirit and don't, an unwavering commitment I was very irresponsible before I came here and I really lacked respect and um, even though it's been hard that's what I needed I needed a bit of a you know really you need a focus girl so that's where I'm at now I'm really present to the energies that have shifted and, and left me um, from from doing the ayahuasca that has me in a space now that I can see um, the preciousness of life and um, I just I'm so I feel I'm alive now I'm awake and I'm alive and I'm so excited about where I can take this now into my life and what I can do with this energy and what I can do with this um, this new found connection to the earth to people to myself I just feel like this is the beginning this is really just the beginning and um, I will continue doing more work and um, I think ayahuasca is the um, most direct way to access um, the, the soul's needs and I'm just really grateful to be here and, and I encourage everybody anybody who's watching this because I was watching these testimonials and wondering whether or not I was going to come here and I encourage anybody who's watching this testimonial to come here and do the work. That's it.